Good morning guys, it's your girl Coco Styles and today I'm just gonna show you guys my morning routine. This is what I do every single day with the exception of changing out my sheets. I do change my sheets every three days um, just because you know you sweat at night and stuff but I just decided today that I'll show you what I do on a daily basis um, to kind of get me going before I start a day of work um, or even if it's just the weekend before I get my day started and I will say this first I usually do not pick up my phone unless it is to just turn off my alarm I don't think anyone has an alarm clock anymore in their homes but I usually just turn the alarm off and that's it and then I get up and then I start my routine so like I said today I'm just going to be actually changing out my sheets and stuff but normally it'll just be me making my bed and kind of going from there so I'm gonna bring you guys along and this is what Coco does in her daily routine well morning routine I'll, I'll probably do one for nighttime routine because it is a little bit different um, but let me know what you guys think and don't forget to hit that like comment the like button <laughs> subscribe and just comment anything that you would like for me to do or anything else you would like to see on this channel all right guys <laughs> so 
So I cleanse my face. Okay, so the next step, what I do is after I pretty much make my bed and stuff, like I said today, I just ended up changing my sheets up, but normally I'm just making my bed. But um, even though I shower at night, I still wake up and cleanse my face before I shower. That is because sometimes it's hot, you're sweating at night, and you just want to cleanse your face again. So I use the micellar cleansing water first. Um, then I use my my Neutrogena um, deep cleanse cleansing um, cream, and then I also go into my Hydro Boost cleansing um, from Neutrogena also. And then I put on some Hydro Boost water gel. I hope you guys can see that. And then my final step is to just put on some Visibly Even. And this is the cheaper version to my um, Bobbi Brown. So take off my glasses. And actually I do put on some contacts, but for the sake of this video right now, I'm just gonna wash my face and um, put the contacts on after, okay? So, I'm just gonna turn on some water. I don't use super hot water on my skin. Um, it's just, I don't think it's good for your skin. But I do end up just dabbing my face before I put anything on it and before I cleanse it with the micellar. So I'll just get, grab some, some, you know, cotton pads and just cleanse my face with some. I'll use one for now. And I'll just do this. And that's just clean all around my face. I'm gonna speed through this because I already have a video on my channel um, in detail. And it's literally the same thing. And this is probably just the only thing that's different, different brand is the micellar water because they didn't have the one that I usually buy. So, and this one's okay. I really like the other one. The Simp, uh, I think it's by Sim Simply, Simply or something like that. All right. Okay, let's grab this out there too. And put that there. Okay, so the first cleansing that I am gonna do is this one here. Yes. Let's do this one. And I just kind of go on in little circles. Listen, I heard you should go upwards to keep your skin from dropping. <laughs> so, this is me. And this feels really good, actually. I don't know. A lot of folks buy like really expensive brands. I just, I kind of stick with what works for me. And I've never had any issues with Neutrogena, with the exception of, uh, from this line, the Hydro Boost line, they have a um, facial scrub. And for me, even though it's sensitive, it's still irritating my skin, so I just don't use it at all. So I just kind of know what works for my skin. And I kind of stick with it. I don't really need to try a bunch of different creams on my face um, and then break out. So I'm gonna wash this off. And what I usually use is a baby rag. <laughs> oh, you guys can see that. And I like these because they're really soft. They're really soft. Let's see, like, keep it here on my face. And I just kind of pat. 
pat it, pat it in to my face. And then what I use is the uh, Hydro Boost cleanser. This is the Gentle Lotion. There's another one that says, uh, it's not lotion, it's something else, but it's not foggy. I actually like this one better. And then I just clean my, my skin. Again, it's an extra cleansing. Listen, I know a lot of people suffer from acne and stuff. And um, I'm a firm believer of just kind of watching what you put in your body. I do think it's genetics when it comes to skin. Um, my mom had really, really nice skin. She, like if she would get like a pimple, she would literally just leave it. She always made sure we didn't pick anything on our faces. And um, and as an adult, and I'm 40 guys, you guys know I just, I just don't, I don't pick with it. And I try to smack my friends' hands who do pick. <laughs> Cause it will leave a mark and then it's just hard to get rid of. Um, so I just kinda let it sit for a second and um, then I'll just rinse it off. But I, the water that I have on now is pretty cool. Um, not warm at all. I don't know, I just like it. It feels really good on my skin so that's what I use. Um, but you can use, I don't know, I just don't recommend hot water on your face. Uh, unless you're like trying to get something down, like some swelling or something. So let's rinse this off. If you guys watch the other video, you're gonna see that I use a mask, um, like a hydro boost mask on my skin. Um, and that's from this line too. I don't, this line, I really love a lot. And again, I don't put a lot of stuff on my skin. And this may not be the right way, but it's been working for me since I've been, <laughs> since I was in elementary. I've never really put a lot of stuff on my skin. Back in the day, <laughs> some of you guys know, Noxzema. My mother had us use a Noxzema, like that was Bible in the house, okay? And Vaseline, I mean Vaseline. We use Vaseline so much on our skin. And the crazy part is we never broke out from Vaseline. I'll be honest, I probably stopped using Vaseline probably <sighs> a year ago. Um, when I started to really wear like foundation and stuff, um, and I'm still very sketchy about putting that on, but I don't wear it every day because I do work from home. So I like to sit, let's just dry in a little bit. Okay. And I don't know, I would recommend you guys trying this line. I like it. Um, and again, the facial scrub, actually, let me show you guys. I still have it. This is the exfoliating for your, for your face. And um, I don't know, it just, it just gave me a little rash like the next day, so I just knew to stop using it. So now I'm gonna put on my Visibly Even and I just kind of rub it in and I go upwards and I just kind of go this way and then let it Dry. What I don't have today is my rose water. So I usually spray the rose water on after I do this, but I ran out and I need to buy some more. So I just kind of let this, let this sit and then I'm good. And that's my little cleansing for the morning. Very simple. And then I'm going to now brush my teeth 
And you guys really don't want to watch that, but <laughs> I guess I'll show it. I'll show that. I don't know if you guys really want to watch this. <laughs> but, this is me. So that's enough of that. And now I'm going to shower and get my day going. Then you know, I'll take you guys to me getting breakfast. Well, making breakfast. Making breakfast um, for today and some of the stuff that I have to do today. So I'm pretty much going to work on my, my vlog and I'm going to probably Make some breakfast. I'm going to probably run out today. Um, I'm not too sure because it's raining really bad in Atlanta today. So I'll probably just chill in the house today. And I'm actually kind of tired. So you guys can do this routine if you just want to just like kind of relax on a rainy day. I'll probably watch some movies. I don't know. Something simple today. But I'm kind of feeling a little sluggish. And actually after I shower, I'm going to take you guys and how I do my meditating routine and probably won't show too much of that because it's kind of sacred but i'll show you guys some stuff but i'm gonna jump in the shower and know you guys cannot come but i'll show you a little something something all right guys all right so this is what i'm gonna use for the shower which is i use this every single day um like every single day every single day you only need a small amount of this and then today I'm gonna actually exfoliate with some of the sugar scrub um, from Raw Sugar. This is a really good, I hope you guys can see, this is a really good um, scrub. There's another brand that I love, but I seem to can't find the, the fragrance that I like. So I'm gonna use these two today. And like I said, this is something that I use every day. This is like 15 to $16, but a little goes a long way. So i picking this up from Target, maybe even Walmart. Um, I usually buy mine from Target, so yes, I'm gonna get in the shower and then I'll show you guys my next step from my morning routine. And it's probably gonna seem long, <laughs> but it's really not that long, guys. All right, I'll see you in a second.
guys, so I'm gonna make some breakfast now. So this is what I typically would eat Monday through Friday. Um, well, let me not say every day. If I make this, the Kamut by itself, um, it's just quick. But if I wanna do like mushrooms and cream peppers and stuff, that takes a little bit longer, but I'm always full until lunch or even a little bit after. So I'm just gonna grab some peppers and stuff out of the refrigerator. All right, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna actually grab some green peppers and red peppers and some onions that I have in here. I've been packaging my stuff a little bit different in my refrigerator and I've actually been liking it. So let's move you there. And then what we're gonna do is we're probably gonna add some tomatoes today. And that's it for here. No. I think I'm gonna add some mushrooms. I'm gonna add mushrooms today because it's kind of late, so this will be like a brunch type of thing. And these are my taki, hen, well, hen of, hen of the wood. I don't know if you guys can see that, but you know, I'm not really good at <laughs> I'm so not good at focusing, but I don't know. Let's see. Oh, yeah, I think so. Yeah, these this kind of has like a meat take a meat uh texture to it. Um sometimes if I feel a little risque, I'll get like some vegan sorry, not vegan. I'll get some some jerk sauce and I'll make like kind of like a jerk mushroom type of thing. I, I like this a lot. There's a few different other ones that I use and I'll probably let you guys see when I go food shopping the next time. But I'm just gonna make something. Today is really gonna be just a chill day. It is so nasty outside. I'm just gonna work on the blog and I'm going to just work on some new content for you guys. I don't want you guys to get bored. So I'm just trying to like switch it up and just kind of mix it up a little bit for you guys. But you guys let me know what you would like to see. And listen, I'm open to it all, except for anything that sounds a little unethical <laughs> but um, i'm gonna get started and start cooking and chopping up some vegetables and stuff and let you guys see how that situation goes for me but it's pretty quick honestly this is quicker than making my kale salad i don't know why um but i'll let you guys see it
So, all right, so I'm just gonna eat breakfast now and just relax for the day. It's really nasty outside today. I'm not even gonna put on contacts. I'm gonna keep my glasses on all day and probably just lounge around in a robe all day, honestly. This is just one of those days. But the point of this was to show you my morning routine. This is the things that I do even on, even th Monday through Friday for my regular work day. Um, I make sure I get a full breakfast and I make sure I meditate, I make sure I shower and make sure I do certain things to start my day. If I don't, I just feel like my day is like not together. And I always make my bed, guys, <laughs> always. Today was an exception. I ended up changing the sheets and stuff, but every single day I make my bed and that's because I just, I was raised like that. So for me, it's just second nature, but I'm gonna have my breakfast now. I'm gonna say my grace and I will catch you guys in the next one. If I do add on to this, it's probably gonna be what I'm working on today, which is the, the blog and um, some other content. But if not, I will catch you guys in the next one. And don't forget to hit that like, comment, and subscribe. And if you stay to the end of this vlog slash morning routine, um, please comment, Coco, we see you. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.